Yo guys, Master Markov here, and welcome to another Steam One-Shot with Spindle. So today we're going to be playing another Indie Arena Booth game demo for 2021, and Spindle is a very unique and probably very niche, I want to say, pixel art action-adventure game that I've seen quite a bit of for the actual game demo, but I can't say I've seen too much like positive review on Steam. And this game deserves a lot more attention than it has. I've definitely, you know, have some bias towards this style of gameplay and the style of graphics because of, well, if you just look at half of the lineup for my Steam one-shots, I feel like it explains itself quite readily. But, I have to say, just this game definitely deserves to have way more attention. And hopefully I could help make that a possibility. So, let's hop right into it. In this short demo, there are checkpoints you will restart from in case you die. Progress will not be saved when you exit the demo. Eh, should be fine. This is a Steam one-shot after all. Hopefully I can do it in one shot. Then again, how long is this demo about to be? Wake up! We have to leave this place. Quickly! Ooh, press J or right click to proceed? How could you be so careless? Come on, bonehead. Follow me. Alright, let's roll. I, I love how, how everything flows so well already just in the demo itself. I mean, just look at this lovely, lovely art style. How is this not like already just amazing just from that? Excuse about what's going on. You touched the spindle. Now we have to deal with it. Come on. The, uh, the spindle? I feel like I... I want to explore the world, but I feel like there's not going to be too much to it quite yet. Because I don't think I have anything really to explore it with quite yet. It's a nice flowing sign. There you are. Follow my lead. I feel it's here. This is very reminiscent of, say, Titan Souls. If anyone has played the original Titan Souls, it's definitely like that. Enough with your shenanigans. <laughs> Come on. Well, I guess it won't let me explore. Oh, what the heck? Dang it. Not here either. No dice. We have to get in there. Somehow. I guess we can't go that way. I guess we gotta go back this way and go to where I saw before. Is that a hole, though? Ooh, crow. A hole. Maybe I could squeeze in. Can you open it from the other side? Looks like I can open the gate from this side. Check this out. Nice! Hmm. Well? Man. These houses look a little bit worse for wear. That's for sure. No, I'd love like a Pokemon game in this kind of style. This actually looks really nice. Even though Coromon is definitely, definitely gonna look really great. But I have not uh, finished actually releasing the demo for that, despite the fact of completing it. An old book with the profits and losses of the village. Okay. What is Markiplier doing up there? Uh. Hey, boy. What are you doing here? Uh. This is my father. There's an earthquake tonight, and I heard screams coming from the cemetery. When I went to check, I found him lying there on the ground. He's the mayor and all that, but I can't imagine why he would go there this late at night. Oh, uh, boy, something evil. It's been incredible pain ever since. I'm out of ideas. Uh, get the rest. I know it sounds strange, but he should have already died by now. Say what? You have to go to the cemetery? I don't think that's a good idea, but if you insist. You see cemetery key. Nice! Hmm. Man, I wonder what's in the windmill. That's pretty cool. I love I love this art, I gotta say. I mean, people do not appreciate the the stylistic choice of retro pixel art games. And it's just so so good. It's like old trove. It, it's very not Old Trove, sorry. Uh, Old Fez. Cemetery of Mar. Hmm. 
the heck is all that? That definitely looks like something evil. Very good. Go, go, go. Can I read any of the headstones? Maybe they'll have Kickstarter backers on it. This is worse than I expected. We have to find out what's going on. Hmm. I don't know if I want to go in here. It's definitely the right place. But be careful. Something's wrong here. Hmm. I don't like where this is going, and I can't even reach that. I guess I'm going to have to get some kind of scythe later on, or sword, or something. So I could bypass half of this stuff. It feels just like Turnip Boy a bit, with all those like little leaves there that I just can't pass until I actually get something to use. How could this even get here? What you see here is part of my strength. Or rather, your strength. Um, why is a pig telling me that? Oh, now that's cool. You've regained some of your power. Oh, cool. Press K to swing the scythe. You know what? See, this is what I like. Somebody actually used WSD and used J, K, L, and I. Why can't more games do that? That's that's the obvious like choice for half of the things. Use J, K, L, I with all of your stuff. Nobody ever does that anymore though, for some weird reason. It's like always gotta be some weird button combination. And I just like J, K, L, I. Now I don't know if I should go deeper into here or if I should go back and like go to the other place that I saw before that had blocked it off. But I'm gonna trust my gut and say I'm gonna go this way first. We'll probably be out of here later. Hmm. Large key over there. Oh. Okay. That's weird. Wait, that's really weird. What? Ooh. Okay. That's strange. That's very strange. Ooh. Hello. Mm, wasn't expecting that. I should probably go and check what that is, but I know that I can't get there yet, so I'm definitely not gonna... Oh, cool. Oh, they have a set pattern? Huh. And I can get it from up there. Ooh. Found Monster Park. In a real game, you'll surely need them. But in this game, it seems that you won't need no- Oh. God. The heck? I'm trying to- Trying to mess me up, man. Ah! Ooh, okay. Okay. Guess I'm not going that way. Uh, I can't even do that either. I gotta go across here first. This is actually very cool. I like how I like no games really do this. I mean, I never really see it. Like a, a platform like this just come back and forth and in and out. Little key. Simple lock's gonna be open with it. Well, there was a simple lock over there. Uh, maybe, maybe I should go back. Well, I kind of sealed my fate here a bit. No, wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Why are you spawning back? Ow. I was not expecting you to spawn back. Hold on. I want to just... Just because I have it. Duh. Well, I was... I definitely was not expecting that of all things to happen. But yeah, let, let's go back. I don't... I don't know if I need to go back or not yet. But I want to go out of here. And I would like to go to over earlier. Now, where where the heck was it, though? I, I completely forgot. Here. This way. I want to see what the heck is over here. I lost my key. Can no longer enter my house. Uh, and I can't go down this way. So I guess that's the re... Well, I have a key. <laughs> Hold on. I just realized I have a key. But also, I should be able to slice down, like, this stuff. Another monster part. I like that it's different monster parts as well. Even though it's the same monster. What the heck? Oh. Ow! I wasn't down expecting that. Oh, this is... Oh, this is... Oh, this is not okay. Ow! God, that, that actually hurt a little bit. Golden key. Find a golden lock. Yeah, I think I'll find it, but oof. Man. That's not, that's not okay. Just gonna go by, you guys. You don't need to worry about me. I, oh. 
right, I forgot. Never mind, you gotta worry about me later. Whoop. Oh my! Okay. Well, that hurt a little bit. Mmm. That, re that really crunched me, though. Like, oh man. Wait, can I get all the way across, or does this hit something? No, okay, I could go all the way across now. Good, good, good. I don't know if I want to open this, no offense. Hmm. That cleared out surprisingly well. Unfortunately, I still have to deal with you. What the heck? Oh, 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 okay. Well, you know, when I don't have a dodge or anything like that, this is not going to be fun. Oh, oh, you start spawning, little dudes! As if you alone weren't enough! God, dingle dingus! Dang it! Oh, man, this is gonna... This, this, this might be a little annoying. Wait, whoa, 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 that wasn't enough to heal? Alright, let's, let's try not to get ourselves with too many things. Try and... Oh, come on. No, 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 oh. Okay, there we go. You gotta deal with ow, as many of these guys as possible before I deal with this guy again. Want to just get rid of everybody all at once? Ooh, okay, all right. Hold up. Guess I can't do that. Dang it! No, you're too far away too. No! Oh, ah! Where'd the other dude go? D. Mmm. Hey, seriously? I got. I'm trying to get rid of this guy. <gasps> but mm, 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 that's not good. Well, at least I come back from the checkpoint there. Please tell me I'm already. A okay, good, 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 good. Hmm. Man, shoot, that hurt a lot because of. <laughs> There's no like dash button. You very much have to, like, predict his pattern a lot more than I was expecting to. Plus, I have no... Oh, man. I didn't even bother to, like, count how many bounces he does. Plus, having to deal with all the enemies, that's gonna be really annoying. Ooh, god. I really should make, like, his bounces... Bounce into stuff. Yeah, there we go. Dang it, he, like, instantly went... Uh-oh. Alright, you, you go towards me, I just need, okay, um, god dang it, duh, oh, I wasn't expecting you to bounce off of him, I didn't think that was gonna work like that, ooh, hey, hold up, can you bounce into this dude, nope, okay, apparently not, uh, let's get him first, ooh, good, got him still. Alright, I'm gonna activate this dude too. I should probably be fine. Get him. Alright. Oh, shoot. Alright. Jeez. Man, dude. I'm going red like a Donkey Kong style boss. Hey! Listen, I played enough Death's Door. I played Reapers enough already this year. I wonder what his deal was. Hello, boy. Thank you. You released me from my torment, and I'm finally free. Before I go, I'd like to give you the last spark of my life force. Oh. So that's why the old man should have died? Is his... pent-up life starting all this? Like, people who refuse to die? Dang, this is like Death's Door! Not that closely, I will say. It's kind of kind of cool, kind of unique. I like it. You did really well. As you could probably guess, I am death. My strength is destroyed, and I can only transfer my essence into this pig. My strength is split into five parts, but you've already found one of them. You have to find the other parts, too. This is where the little demo, den the little demo ends. You can freely explore the area and discover one or two secrets. If you enjoy the spindle demo, thank you for the support. Oh, that's cool. I actually did really enjoy that. That was actually really nice. I like the little boss fight. Hmm. Yeah, this this does feel kind of Titan Souls-esque. And especially because of the fact that you said, like, there's, you know, five things like that. 
So, I'm guessing one of the secrets was literally this dude, but I, I can't imagine where he would have lost his keys. Like, he said he lost his keys to his house. I don't know exactly what that would mean. Oh, oh, the wood is gone. Ah, okay. Oh, dang! I wasn't expecting you. I was not expecting the little egg boy to just come out of nowhere. I, I really enjoyed that, though. Man, I love, I love how this demo is going so far. I wish, unfortunately though, I had a little bit longer reach as like an upgrade later on. Like, not saying that I need longer reach by default, but like, I'd like to be able to upgrade it. Like, I'd love that. I'd love, I'd love to see like character progression with this guy. Because it seems so cool and so, so awesome to just like, play as this dude. Hmm. So I'm guessing because the wood is down, maybe this is the next area, supposedly? But I'm not entirely sure. Let's go down here first, because this area seems way more secretive. Uh, I guess there's nothing here. For now. For now. Can I go this? I can go this way. Unfortunately, it has caused my imminent, uh, demise. Great. Let's head up here. Ooh. Well, now this is nice. Got a nice little fishing guy over here. Oh, this is cool. Fishing is fun by P Bis Piscars Fisher. Hint 32. The secret is not to pull on the fishing rod like a savage. Pacing good ob observation of the keys to success. That's nice. I mean, you don't seem to have any fish. Ooh, will there be like a fishing thing in this demo? Or, sorry, not in the demo, but in the full game? Huh. That's weird how I'm like in the wall a bit like that. It's just an uh, odd visual glitch that they decided to, to, to do, I guess. Hi, oh, you scallywag. If you want to fish, just stand at the end of the pier and press J. Sure, I'd love to. Fishing rod. Press J to set the direction of power and throw. WSD move bait. If a fish is taking the bait, press J rapidly and pull on it. I to stop. What? Oh, uh, sure. Oh, oh, I see. I see what they mean then. So, if I keep pulling I to stop, pull I to s That's gonna be- oh, god! Okay, alright. Uh, you pull I to stop, pull I to stop. Dang it! Oh, god! That's, that's actually really tough. This is really, really, really tough. Pull... I pull... Oh, no, okay. How do I... How would I even, like, do that? Can I move it, like, further back? Hmm, okay. So, it shouldn't... You shouldn't really... Do press I to stop. Got a firefish. Ooh, nice. Go up, go up, go up. Yeah, there we go. You should just let go. That's what you should do. Just stop tapping so much. Don't tap like a maniac. God, this is this is just like Spirit Fair. Nice! Hey, we got a big in. Cool. I like it. Come here, fishy, fishy. Come here. I just need a rapid tap. Hey, what do we got now? Caught a dream fish. Ooh. Hold up, you over there. What do you got? Hold, hold on a moment. No, no! Ah, god! Eh. Guess I'm gonna have to catch him a little bit later. Oh, no, no, no. Perfect. Alright. Yeah. Right there. Hey! Yeah, there we go. No! I, I stopped! Oh! Wow, that was way more power than I imagined. Come on. Get on there, you little fish. Oh, man. This is, like, so tough. The more you let go, it's like the harder it gets. That's for sure. 
Like, I need to give them a little slack and then a couple seconds to enjoy the slack. I wasn't expecting, you know, this to be- Oh, it's so close! No, I, I need to, I need to, I need to move it like... Can I move it down? I can only go up- oh, okay. Well, I guess let's throw a line out here. Why am I enjoying this fishing mini game so much? I love fishing mini games and games way too much. I think it adds like a lot of uh, a lot of calmness, a little way to just like find some modest relaxation inside what otherwise would be high intensity games. Besides like Stardew Valley. Stardew Valley, I just enjoy it. Like almost. What the heck are you? Hold on, what are you? What the heck is this? What is that? Is this a sea? It's not, it's not, it's not fighting back. <gasps> I was gonna say it's not fighting back. Now what the heck was that thing? Hold on, now what the heck was that thing? No, 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 no. You. What are you? Yeah, fight me. Oh, God. Man, I wasn't expecting that. Ooh, monster part. What the heck? Oh, that's cool. All right, hold up. I I, I think we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, oh, man. I think that was pretty cool. That was actually really nice. I could just fight a dude. Oh, man. That's cool! Oh, why is this game already so cool? See, this is why I say it's not getting enough love. It's just so, so worth it, though. Well, unfortunately, I can't do anything about that, I guess, uh, since I don't have a key. Shame, though. Hmm. So where else could I go? I can't imagine there's too many other places, and since I can't just, like, fish off of this dock... Where exactly would I be able to go besides this? I kind of started the game like here, didn't I? So, I don't know where else I could really go. Hmm. I just feel like there's got to be another thing here somewhere, somehow. Somewhere, somehow, there's got to be another thing. Here. Just attack the wall. I mean, I don't know. Some of the walls have moss on it, and I don't know if that's supposed to be an indication of anything or what. Nah, huh? Hello? So you made it this far. I've been to the forest before. Maybe there's a few things to discover. We're the developers of Spindle and we hope you like the demo. And you support us on Kickstarter. Because we're so nice, we'll now enable a new skill. Press L to switch between yourself and the pig. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. Playing as the pig is awesome. Oh, what the heck? That's cool. Oh, that's cool. Wait, but what would I be able to access now is the pig. What could the pig do that I can't do? This is way too cool. This is way too cool. I don't deserve a game as awesome as this. Also, the fact that they, like, recognize that I... Hmm. Hmm. What the heck? The chickens. Oh, hey, I could go in all the houses. I, I didn't even realize that. Uh, cat. Oh, cute kitty. Hmm, I guess nothing in here. This is pretty- wait, wait, hold up. Let me check that one book that was right there. I know I probably isn't gonna do anything, but... Mm. God, look at- look at this! This is so cool! Why is this game so amazing? Not much to do. I've already repaired the bridge to the southeast. Oh, yeah! Wait, right, that was, uh, that was messed up. Oh, God! Hold up. It's like Cluckos! Oh god, they actually attack back! Thank god they don't infinitely attack me like this is Legend of Zelda. Thank god for that. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. I knew it! Told you! Cook for neighbors who help us well. Then everything will be as it has always been. Hmm? Pancakes. Half liter of milk, four eggs, 300 grams of flour, three to four tablespoons of mineral water, salt, oil, sugar for sprinkling, stir all ingredients together and pour into a hot pan, get it out before pancake burns. Well, that is how you would make pancakes, I suppose. It's cool! This is a cool little village that you could just enjoy. I like that. What's this? 
The Book of the Brave. In this book, those who have the courage to support the game will be written down. Go to our Kickstarter page to find out more. Oh, that's cool! Oh, oh, that's cool. That's nice. Oh, that's so nice. Book of the Brave. God. That's nice earthquake. Cause a lot of damage. I'm glad our neighbors support us so much. I go like, yeah, no, okay. I don't want to try attacking the chickens too much more. Uh, was this? No, this was this guy's house. Being the mayor is certainly not easy, but I could do it. Look at patrons! Oh, the Patreon people as well! Hey, wait, Anokurp was there twice, and P8 too. And Shinin. Man, oh man, I love this. I love this. This is amazing! You already have that kind of stuff in your demo? That's immediately amazing. Let's see. I, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for what's about to happen, but I have to see what's up with this. I have the feeling the other villagers don't even want to believe it. Yeah, well, I'm so sorry. I, I, I technically had to reap him, and that's... Mm, that is such a shame. Hmm. So this is the milling station. Oh! Oh! Oh, what is this? Rock. Uh, L? Pig, can you do something? Oh! Oh, he can do something. Hold on. L. Let's go over here. Switch to the pig. Can you go like... Aha! Oh my god, that's cool! So now I have the ability to swap. Meaning that... Oh, what the heck is that? Ow. Can I... Fight you? Oh shoot! I might, I might need a. Is there something else I could do somehow? Oh, you know what? Maybe he could like take the vases. Ah, yes, that's what he could do. He could shoot the vases at him. Okay, that's nice. Awesome. All right, now that we have that, um, obviously I guess we got to go like this. Just take that out. Hold up. Can I go, like, uh, take the vase? Will this just break this? No, it will not. It just breaks eventually. That's actually really cool, though. I gotta say, what the heck? Like, this game is, like, really cool mechanics. Oh, no. Oh, no. I may, I may have done goofed myself already. Um. Whoops. Hold up. If I go back... I go back here. I have to solve a, a pushing puzzle now, don't I? Yeah, I do. What? I can't I can't push this guy anymore. Oh, well, I guess I could push this, push this, push this. Yeah. Hmm, guess I can't do anything with that. What the heck is up with this skull though? Hmm, wait, what is up with up here? Look at that! What the heck? Why is like... Oh, I can't, oh, I can't do anything with that. That's odd. Hmm. Uh... Hmm. Weird? And I can't... Oh, oh, I get it. I'll sit here. I go like this. Shoot this. Oh, what? Go like this. Shoot this. It lands normally. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Wait, let's... Oh, dang it. Nope. Hold up. <laughs> Hold up. Oh, that's cool. Thanks for assembling. Take these coins as a thank you. I have no idea what to do now. Maybe I'll become a model. What the heck? That's awesome! That's cool! <laughs> I discovered a dancing skeleton! Come on, that's pretty good. That's pretty cool. You can't- you cannot deny that was a pretty cool thing. God, this demo is so filled with cool stuff! This is way better than any Kickstarter demo has any right to be. I, I gotta admit, like, right now. Like, that, that is cooler than any Kickstarter demo has any right to be, is just have all this. Plants are thriving this year, but everything will be fine in the end. 
I know it's in the earthquake. Hmm. Well, you're a blacksmith. I suppose you're used to the loud pangings of, uh, earthquake. Hmm. Nothing in here I could do anything with, though. Though I guess technically I could go like this, and then go like, bink. Oh, well. Shoot. <laughs> oh well, oh, I'm sure they won't miss their fine china. Hmm. But yeah, do you, do you think I could kill the chicken? No, no way. I don't think I could kill the chicken, unfortunately. But yeah, oh my god, I, I love everything that's going on here. It, it's been an amazing demo so far. I love the combat. Combat's pretty nice. I love how many different various things are on the world. And how how fun half of the stuff is. You have a literal fishing mini game in the demo, which like brings up a secret like kind of mini boss fight. You have a whole area over here that has the devs team dedicated like right here. I mean, how could you not love that? I think I think I gotta say I really really am highly enjoying the rest of this demo. It's it's been great. It's been just everything you could possibly want and more. And I love that about this. A demo that showcases not only gameplay. But showcases bits of the future of the game and just how much the dev team can do, can pursue, is able to pursue. And I love that. And I really hope this game gets the best. So if you guys like this video, like, comment, subscribe down below. Hope to see you next time with more Steam One Shots, more Indie Arena Booth game demos, and more Spindle. Peace! Oh, I even pet the pig.